this is an extraordinary sight. Goose bump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Hey, admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds, the Undertaker. Long, harrowing walk to the ring by the Phenom. The personification of evil. Such an ominous and chilling aura when The Undertaker comes to town. This is always his stage. It's always his yard. And if you're his opponent, you know the end is near. Three decades of dominance. The dead man's wrath is unending. An unspeakable reign of terror over the WWE. And this is the moment where there is no turning back for The Undertaker's opponent. Welcome to damnation. It's Vader time! And his opponent from the Rocky Mountains, weighing in at 450 pounds, the man they call Vader! You want to know what kind of a man Vader is? A bad, bad man. He once ripped off Mick Foley's ear. I think that's not necessarily a bad fate, considering I sit next to Saxton every week. Well, hey, I heard that. He fears no man. He feels no pain. Check your watches, because it's time. It's time. It's Vader time. This poor superstar has just stepped onto the battlefield against the last outlaw. It's going to be a long night for this guy. There's the battle, and now it truly is Vader time. Vader's mission in every match is simple. He wants to punish his opponent as much as possible. And that's where the devastating and bone-crushing attacks come in. Vader comes at you with no remorse. He won't stop until you're utterly pulverized. Inflicting massive amounts of pain just comes naturally for the man they call Vader. And across the ring from him is the Reaper. Just evoking the Undertaker's name is enough for someone to become frozen with fear. No lies detected there, Corey. I was nine when I first saw The Undertaker, and his aura today is just as, if not more chilling. And he gets the shoulder up before two. Could be in search of a second win now. Good Lord, talk about getting drilled. A fire has been lit inside of the monstrous Vader. Vader is now fully in control. Oh, he counters right back. 
back on Vader. Drop in the leg. Look, we know The Undertaker loves to show off his athleticism for such a big guy, but I couldn't see... Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. Really thought that was going to work, but now we got a human being we have to scrape off the floor. Getting back into the ring. What's coming next? Taking their time. Punch to the gut will take the win right out of you. Despite his impressive agility, Undertaker unable to avoid that. Hard hitting damage coming from Vader. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Stop in the leg. The dead man into the last ride. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Lift off, Dirty brain chop. And Vader reverses it. Ooh, ow, ow, ow. loving blow to the chest. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Oh, what a headbutt. Oh no, trapping the arm. A vicious stomps to the hand. Thunder a shot to the oh. back. Oh, hammer and sickle. Oh, and a reversal. The time has arrived to rest in peace. Rest in peace. The Undertaker just ended this. Rope breaks the hold there. He moved, but can he capitalize? This match's brutality starting to show on him. Yeah, as The Undertaker can get to you and break you down in so many ways, and that was one of them. Setting him up for the flatliner. A bit of provocation from The Undertaker. Oh, no! Crashing hard! To the floor. Talk about a jumping nothing. A real miscalculation on their part. Planted with a neck breaker. Leg drop. And he was ready for Undertaker. Ow! Caught with a punch. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. And this might not have a pleasant ending. And The Undertaker got busted up by that last attack. The claw is in. Agonizing. Ref still counting, close to calling it. Hurry back in. He climbs back into the ring just in time. That was getting close. Chest. Undertaker is now under pressure. We may be seeing a dead man walking. Into the corner. This can't be. The Mastodon with the setup. We know what comes next. That being the end if Vader lands this. Here it comes. Vader Bob. The Undertaker in a bad way. Two. No. My, that was close. Oh, my gosh. The Undertaker. Taker resists his demise. Amazing resilience from the dead man. I've lost count of how many times this match should have ended by now. Oh, a joke slam. The Undertaker proving his offense still just wrecks the competition. Like a wrecking ball. 
Watch the quickness on this. Bang! Snap suplex. Fighting tooth and nail back and forth for supremacy. This could be anyone's match. War waging on. The battle yet to be settled. Memory's got to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. Undertaker is going up top. From the top. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. Uh oh, uh oh. Return fire from the Undertaker. The dead man lining up his next victim moments away. The Undertaker looking to finish this now. And down with the tombstone. What devastation from The Undertaker. He's on the ropes. The official sees it and waves off the pen. Big drop of the leg. Listen to this place. Oh, boy. He's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Oh, God. You have daring and you have stupid. That was stupid. It was a daring decision that didn't provide the expected result. Yeah, stupid. Uh-oh. This is astonishing. A shock in awe moment. The dead man's trail of destruction comes to a stop. Here come two dudes with attitudes. These two have been running roughshod over the WWE ever since they joined forces. Yeah, now the combined power of Diesel and the athletic ability of HBK have made them unstoppable. I agree, as long as their egos don't get in the way. We've seen these two bend the rules on many occasions. I call them two dudes with bad attitudes. I'm sure they'll sleep well at night with all the titles and money they've earned. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the WWE World Tag Team Championship! Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 550 pounds, the Rude Warriors! And their opponents at a combined weight of 544 pounds, the World Tag Team Champions, Diesel and Shawn Michaels. Dudes with attitude. The goal is obtaining those tag team championships. Being on the same page will be vital in this one.
Here we go with HBK and Diesel teaming up once again, a team built of power and speed. Yeah, there's no wonder why they've been so successful. The two dudes with attitudes are nearly unstoppable between the ropes, but we've seen them butt heads before. Yeah. He gets tagged in. Just a debilitating neck breaker. Oh! Boom! Bam! Oh! Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm! There's the tag. Slam. You have to be in peak physical condition to pull off a move with that much weight behind it. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. And Diesel connected nicely right there. Big time. Planning on what to do next. Holy! That was an awful landing. The fight could get very dangerous out at ringside now. Tag. Raw tag made. Right to the midsection. Tandem offense in effect. A good team knows how to truly work as one. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, no, it is aggression, just pure brutality. Come on, easy. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. The challenger eating up some damage. Yeah, and Michaels looked far from washed up. Treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. And now thrown back into the ring. Two. 
What's Michaels putting together? And an inverted atomic drop. The challenger is not in a great place. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Michaels hooks it up. Teardrop suplex to retain the title. Well, what a save. Corey, that should have been three. I couldn't agree more. I can hear the band playing already, gentlemen. Eight. Oh, here it comes. Oh, spiked him. Looks like the champ is going to retain. Makes the cover. He's still in this fight. Just barely able to kick out. I thought the champ had it in the bag. This is how much the championship means. You can see the sweat trip out of the challengers. Every point soaring. Oh, impact. Relentless offense from Michaels. Good luck stopping Shawn Michaels at this rate. That's a good tag. Up he goes. Devastating. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, this is just disrespectful. And an elbow drop, too. Slides him back to the mat. Six. And targeting the leg there. Cover by the champ. Oh, I thought the champ had it. What a match. And off the tag is Shawn Michaels. Headlock. Oh, and a cheap shot right above the eye. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Michaels putting it all on the line. Sky high. Oh, misses the mark. Stiff headlock. Military press. Tagged into the action. Taking out the arm, great strategy. The champ getting put to the test here. We are seeing the will to win from these men. Not an ounce of quit in them. The struggle to gain power has switched hands multiple times. It's been a seesaw battle at times. Also looks like Sean's busted open now. He got whipped into that corner. These two trading counters and an absolute master class. Hey. Drop kick on target. Uh oh. Suicide dive. Whatever it takes to win. Like a heat seeking missile hit the target right on the mark.
Yes, tag! Oh, that might have just now a pin for the championship. He keeps his team in the match. Grabs a hold of HBK. Snap power slam. The champ eyes look glazed over. Oh, kicks out, kicks out. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. This was the moment to capitalize on. That should have been the end. Elbow drop. Really just laying it in. And Sean takes on a further beating there. Yeah, Michael's finding himself in a tougher situation than he expected here. this crowd. Ooh. Just hot shot it to the outside. Right, he's got him here. He's got him up. And no! Lives to fight another day. Whitney Larian. Quickly into the cover of the title of the line. New champion. New champion. Got it. And the tag titles change hands here tonight. Here is your winner, and new the Animal! And a big time victory for this tag team here tonight. I hope this is just a bump in the road for Sean and Diesel. As good as they are, they do not take losing well. To start this off with a show of respect. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. In for it. A chaotic start to this matchup. They should have known better than to take the bait. Obviously, a total lack of respect between these two. Tension's incredibly high. As this match gets underway, there's clearly no love lost in this one. Here we go. Ah, down on the face. Hooked up. DDT. Oh, oh, oh. Gosh. Just like that, Lita counters. Sidewalk slam. Rolling into a monkey flip. Just got thrown around like a sack of you know what. Springboard. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. What goes up must come down, and it sure as hell did right there. A oh, costly error there. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. And perhaps overconfident Lita running into some trouble there. And that's the kind of offense that's made Stratus a trailblazer in this division. Up high, cross body. Shoulders down, this could be it. Not even a one count there. She still has enough energy for a simple kick out. Oh, gets out of that by using a jawbreaker. She's still as determined as ever. Lita showing no fear, no intimidation. Oof. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Snapmare driver, they're out. And Stratus getting a taste of the worst right there. Lita's veteran instincts in action. Leg 
drop. Up goes lead up, thinking extreme. Flying. Good Lord, taking flight. Just crashing down with high impact. Oh, oh, oh. Gosh. Unbelievable intensity from Lita. Somehow Trish has to turn the tide. Rolling into a monkey flip. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Made her pay for her mistake. Trish managing to get some control back now. Could be what Trish needed to ignite a rally. Spine Buster! With a sit out. Nasty. That unraveled on Trish. Going way up high. Launching. She's starting to tire a little. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This map from the top. Stratus is completely out of it. Just breaking down the opponent. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Fast press. Fast press. Fast press. Ooh, elbow strike. is it interrupts the offense with a clubbing strike Go behind. Shoulders down. could she finally put this away in the room saber there Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. Wicked clothesline! Watch out! Trying to go in the cover! Shoulder up! Shoulder up! Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Stratus now getting in position. and took them off their feet. Back and forth, Trish and Lita refusing to hold back against each other. That's because this is about pride. This is proving who really is the better woman. That is just pure instinct at this point. She's taking things to ringside. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Kick to the body. Lita with the DDT. Lita was right on target. Is it enough? The cover. Two. No, she kicked out. Trish reached deep into the well for that one, but she has to know that was as close as it gets. Lita has to ask herself, what more from the top? Lita sold by Lita. The lights are dimming for Trish. Two. Lita has done it. hoping they'd shut them up here. Credit where credit's due when it comes to the victory, but it seems their disrespectful ways will unfortunately remain intact. I know they made a point earlier on to show that they had no... The Hall of Famer, George the Animal Steel. And Steel's not unorthodox. He's a danger to society. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 275 pounds, George Steel!
The Animal is one of the most unique and beloved competitors in WWE history. You never know what will happen when he competes. Here we go. Look at this guy. How is this a sanctioned match? Does he know the rules? Can he even read them? Look who's here. The cream of the crop has arrived. And his opponent from Sarasota, Florida, weighing in at 239 pounds, Macho Man Randy Savage. One of the all-time greats, truly a once-in-a-lifetime talent. The Macho Man Randy Savage. Incredible, incredible superstar, Hall of Famer, legend. <laughs> That's right. There is only one macho man, Randy Savage. You are looking at the personification of unrivaled intensity. And the macho man, Randy Savage, as intense as he is charismatic. It's unusual that George Steele waits for the bell, but we'll go with it. Steele is one of the most unorthodox, bizarre competitors in history. There's a reason he's known as the animal. Just look at him. He resembles the missing link, and I'm not sure, but I think they share the same vocabulary. Yeah, Byron, but don't let the wild man image fool you. Steele is extremely gifted with an arsenal of holds and locks. You can't fight his chaos. You just have to grin and bear it. And on the other side of the ring is the Macho Man. Almost no one enters the ring with such intensity, such purpose to take their opponent out. You can't get complacent around Macho Man. He thinks of every possible scenario and leaves nothing to chance. When he comes for you, he doesn't stop until the job's done. Trying to fight with a hurt arm is no easy task. And Steele is able to be tamed at the moment. Yeah, Macho Man is showing how the cream always rises to the top. And an elbow. Oh, did we just see a tooth fly out? Oh, what a strike to the back. He saw that one coming. I think something you have to do against Randy Savage is keep him out of the air. Keep everything on the ground and away from the top rope. Do you agree? Completely, Cole. Savage is so cunning, so quick. Most of his offense requires creating distance between himself and his opponent. Staying on top of Savage and keeping him on the mat prevents him from taking to the air. Put it in position now. Down on the wind pipe. That could be it. And he gets his shoulder up before the count. Maybe that was just to keep his opponent off balance. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. Right to the back of the neck. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. This maniac's out of control. Savage dealing with an unfavorable circumstance right there. An eruption of offense from Steele. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Now look at his aggression, just pure brutality. Come on, easy. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. He takes control. Oh, side coming. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. Side, jeez. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Dominating shoulder tackle. Elbow drop. Piercing. At the height of the knee drop from Macho Man. And he goes for the pin. Kick out at one. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, right in the face. 
My God. The Macho Man is going berserk. Can Steel recover from this adversity? Strike punch. Jar quickly to cover. Almost two and a half. Wow. Uses the edge of the knee. He thinks he has it. He's able to kick out before two. So resilient. Going right after the arm and taking down their opponent effectively. Just twist. He may get the three count right here. I think so. No, stops the count. Two. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Mistake made by Steele. in front of us. And how these competitors are still surviving is beyond explanation. Boom! Face first. Macho Man dodges. This is disgusting! Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Over the top rope. Oh, this is vicious. And it looks like they have no problem bending the rules there. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Oh. Risks like that. Two. Ah, claw to the face. Ripping at the eyes. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Macho man getting set. From way up high. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. He scared the daylights out of him. Hits him with the counter. What a bionic elbow. You can sense it. This crowd is on pins and needles. The WWE Universe is ready to erupt. Are we close to the beginning of the end? Sharp knee. Randy Savage, the cream of the crop. Few bring the intensity like Randy Savage. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Ooh. <laughs> what a right hook. Slam! What impact. And Macho is moving like a man possessed. Like a man on top of his game. Savage now perched high atop the ropes. And George is laid out.
gets delivered back into the ring. What are they doing here? And now he's producing some overwhelming offense. What offense from the Macho Man. First up top. Oh, and he doesn't connect. Er, tearing at the face. Jawbreaker counter to get out of that. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? What a unique submission maneuver here. And look at That's it. The blood and sweat put into this match. Well worth it. Here is your winner, the Animal Steel. This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. It's difficult to describe what we just witnessed, but the win tonight goes to the Animal. Completely unpredictable is a key to victory for George Steele. At least it was tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. A reaction that can only be for one individual. Muhammad Ali is in the building. Many consider Muhammad Ali to be the greatest heavyweight boxing champion of all time. Ali will need those skills that helped him reach such heights. Michael, just think of the range of opponents Ali's defeated. All different ages, heights and weights, fighting styles and backgrounds. Ali can adapt to any foe. Muhammad looks to be in fantastic physical condition. To his opponent, you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Ali's going to give the people what they've been waiting to see. Here he is, the one true superstar. The Hall of Famer, superstar Billy Graham. Pontificating, outrageous, charismatic, superstar Billy Graham is a true pioneer of sports entertainment. You're right, Cole. This is a man who deserves an entire wing of the WWE Hall of Fame. With a real superstar in the building, we are about to see something special. Many Hall of Famers pattern themselves after Graham, and we are all about to see exactly why. Introducing the challenger from Louisville, Kentucky, weighing in at 236 pounds, Muhammad Ali! And his opponent from Paradise Valley, Arizona, weighing in at 275 pounds, the WWE Heavyweight Champion, Superstar. You can see it in everyone's eyes. They all want this championship. We're underway here with the man with the largest arms in the world, superstar Billy Graham. 
Graham is a legit super athlete whose feats of strength range from twisting tire irons into pretzels to pulling trucks strapped to his body. Billy Graham is truly one of a kind. His mythological strength crushes bones into dust. But he better be quick on his feet because he's going to have to dodge the fists of the greatest boxer of all time, Muhammad Ali. I cannot imagine what facing Ali in the ring is like. The speed, the stamina, that knockout power, completely legendary and unmatched in all regards. There's something so elegant about the way he wraps that all up into the complete package that he is. Graham steers clear of that. Close line! Off with their head. He must have had that scouted. He's been placed in the corner now. Non-stop blows. Just using their foot as a weapon. So ruthless. Covered by the champ. He forces a break before the count of two. And those kickouts are only going to get harder. He turns it around. from Grant. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. And Muhammad Ali's confidence was just kept in check. Graham making an example of his opponent. So much damage inflicted. An impressive chain of moves from Billy Graham. Some hellacious offense from Billy. And right between the shoulder blades. Finds a counter for Graham. Prime opportunity now for Muhammad Ali to get some separation and gather himself. I'm getting dizzy just watching. Wheels are turning in Ali's head. Great counter. Down to Bonin and a double axe handle smash. Oh, time to get dizzy. Take over, Byron. I'm going to be sick. Apps has the challenger pinned. Is this it? Stops the ref count before two. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of him. Lands the knee. The challenger not looking good right now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Oh, my goodness. Oh, and a stop. Ali can't escape this pressure here. Ali is getting cut off at the knees at every turn. He switches it back around. for his opponent. Denied with an elbow. Big boot to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Vicious right forearm. An impressive chain of moves from Billy Graham. Some hellacious offense from Billy. Jumping elbow drop. The challenger's hopes are slipping away. I don't want to say he's done, but I can hear the perched up top. I mean, knee drop for the title. Breaks the count of two. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Superstar Billy Graham cinching in the bear hug. A bear hug by superstar Billy Graham. He's got a lot there. Furiously trying to fight his way out of the bear hug. Can he do it? Yes. Big close line. He's heading up top. Thinking big. He's lining him up. From the top. Double axe handle connects.
impact to the stomach. Down he goes. We knew this was going to be brutal, but didn't imagine carnage like this. Well, I guarantee no one had this on their bingo card. A superstar hook in the arm. Look at this rush of strikes. Every ounce of the body is a target. Punch to the stomach connects. A relax. Oof. The title might change hands. Pin. Hangs on by a thread. This is complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Textbook scoop slam. Muhammad Ali heading up top. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Placing them into the corner. No escape from these punches. So ruthless. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Oh, look at that scope slam. Ah, oh, look at this, just cranking it out. Just cranking the head. An unyielding Billy Graham on the attack. Graham is proving hard to deal with. Perched up top. Look out below. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Discus punch. Powerbomb position. But right hands create separation and an escape. Oh, wait a second. Caught in midair. Oh. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Caught with that sharp elbow. Rick. Submission. Give up now. Swallow your pride and submit. Just hang on. Hang on for just a little bit longer. He's risking permanent damage. And superstar Billy Graham keeps the title. Here is your winner, and still the WWE Heavyweight. for the champ as he retains the title. He came out here and defended what was his. You have to give him credit.